Glyphosate is showing up in way more foods than people realize, even in eggs. So here's what it's doing to your body and how you can actually avoid it. Research shows that glyphosate doesn't just pass through the body. It can build up in organs, breast milk, and even the brain. It slows metabolism by damaging mitochondria and blocking your ability to properly make energy. It increases oxidative stress and DNA damage, raising risks for cancer and kidney and liver issues. It can act as an endocrine disruptor, impacting fertility and hormones. It even creates epigenetic changes that can impact future generations and it disrupts the gut microbiome, killing beneficial bacteria and letting more harmful ones take over. But there is good news. Studies show that switching to organic or chemical-free foods can drastically lower your glyphosate levels. One study found a 70% drop in just six days. Grains like oats, wheat, and legumes tend to test the highest. So sourcing organic or chemical-free matters, especially if you eat those regularly. And livestock feed can contain high levels too. Multiple studies have found glyphosate in eggs, even organic ones. This is why we built ancient Angel Acres Egg Club the way that we did. Instead of buying chicken feed from big suppliers and hoping that it's clean, we make it ourselves. We partner directly with regenerative row crop farm partners who produce the ingredients for our custom corn and soy free feed without glyphosate. And we are proud that third party lab tests confirmed that our eggs contain zero glyphosate. Real food shouldn't be a mystery. So for everyone a part of Angel Acres Egg Club, thank you for being a part of rebuilding a food system built on small regenerative farms and truly clean food.